Hi everyone, Social Solipsist here, and I'd like to introduce you to a couple of new things. Actually, if you see up in the left-hand corner, and ignore the house for right now, um, if you see up in the left-hand corner, you'll see that we've upgraded to Minecraft Beta 1.5. Um, it just got updated today, which is... what is today? 19th, I believe? April 19th. Um, well, for another 30 minutes. Um, and I don't actually know what it involves. Clearly, um, my dogs can now go through doors. I just discovered that. Also, I thought I'd introduce you to all the work I've done while you guys have been gone. Slash, I haven't been recording because I don't feel like talking that much. Because this has taken me forever. Um, as you can see, the floor is all done and it's pretty. And this is all wool, um, that I dyed. Um, lots of... All the stuff is still in there. This is, like I said, I filled in the whole floor like this. I still have my eight dogs. have my bed in my little alcove here, which I actually ended up waking up. It's interesting. I was sleeping there one night, and I woke up with a skeleton next to me. It shot me once, and my eight dogs swarmed it, and it was dead within seconds, which is nice because otherwise I probably would have died by it because I was totally surprised by it because I had no idea how it got in. Turns out I left a gaping hole down there in the glass. Um, <coughs> also, um, what else? I guess, well, I don't think this was here last time. Yeah, let me just show you outside. <laughs> Voila. Yeah, I'm I'm pretty proud of myself actually. Um, I did this all without any hacking or anything like that, um, except for the gold tools. I told you guys about the gold tools just to speed things, speed the process up a little bit. So if I go up here, you'll see this is all one block of lava because I wanted to both has have a disposal down there and as well when I'm up here or out there actually be able to see this giant tower of lava so that's a nice thing um, I also have this massive farm now if you go back to my old video or you remember the old video um, videos plural this used to be a giant hill um, basically what I did well it's a long story basically this entire thing was solid hill up here and I mined it all out um, Basically, my plan was to mine out the bottom of it and leave the top on um, with a little augmentation so that I could grow trees that wouldn't that I could reach the tops of. Um, so that worked out quite well. I haven't harvested it because I don't need the wood. But up on top here, and this is where I screwed up a little bit because I realized, well, I should have just you know dug down from the top and obliterated the whole thing, is my massive wheat farm. And... I, I'm, this, it's my belief that this is the perfect wheat farm. There's probably ones that are more productive, but in terms of actual viability with harvesting and whatnot, um, I've placed glass in there so things won't go in the water. They always bounce back at me when I harvest them. Um, again, not going to harvest that either because I don't really need it. Um, but it was, I guess it was kind of for shits and giggles because I don't really use, I, I have plenty of wood already and I don't really use a whole lot of wheat. Yeah, on the other hand, um, mineral wealth, I have none. So, um, we're gonna do some exploring. I think I'm all prepared. Oh, um, in case somebody's wondering, yes, that is a stack of 16, um, what do you call it? Uh, whatever, you see it in my inventory, a stack of 16 pork. Um, I added in a mod funny story. I added in a mod that allowed me to stack food up to 16, but basically once it was stacked, I couldn't use it. I had to unstack it before I could use it. Otherwise, you know, like it's cheap. I think I actually mentioned I was planning on doing that. So I installed that. Two days later, today, it updates to 1.5 and that no longer works. I'm keeping the stack though because it saves me inventory space, which is basically what I wanted it to do in the first place. The thing is, once I unstack it, I can't stack it back again until I, until um, the mod gets updated. I believe it's um, 
Risugami's more stacking mod. Yeah, something like that. Also, from what I've heard, um, with this update, uh, trees, the special kinds of trees like birch and pine, will drop birch and pine saplings. They don't just drop regular saplings. They're no longer limited resources. They, You can regrow any kind of tree now. Um, so, where the hell am I headed? Um, I scouted out a cave because I remember last time I didn't and... The cave was super lame because it wasn't really a cave. Uh, wasn't really a cave at all. Um. So yeah. Okay. Just making sure, dog. Thought maybe you had jumped off a cliff. Pathing is a little bit better. Okay. I take it back. <laughs> also, it it also appears that um they can eat regular meat now. Yeah. Yeah, they can. I noticed that by accident earlier when I was trying to eat it and he ran in front of me and... Ooh, frame rate skip. Sorry. Um, yeah, and I happened to give it to him and he didn't get hurt. Which is kind of surprising. Ah, there we are. I made a giant pillar of doom. Um, is this it? Yeah, okay. So, yeah. Let's start on this cave. I haven't actually scouted it that much, but given the mineral content that's right here, I'm okay with, you know, whatever this turns out to be. <laughs> Iron is welcome. I am non-discriminatory against iron. That's weird, I don't know. Okay, um, yeah, like I said, pathing's still not great. It just knocked me... Get the fuck out of my way. I... I swear... They okay, it might just be because I have a whole lot of wolves, but I'm of the opinion that they are more of a... <coughs> of a nuisance than a help. I mean, yeah, they're really nice in on some occasions. That's what you fucking get. You, you jump in front of... You know what? I have no patience for that thing. Are you are you shitting me? Really? Really? That's that's the cave. Damn it. Oh well. I swear to god I'm going to kill that thing. I I may be a heartless person and all my friends who play Minecraft may get really pissed at me because you know, I'm killing off a rarity, but for god's sake, I have 8 of them and I don't really like them. Am I a bad person for that? I mean, it's not that I don't like them. I love them. I love them very much. But the pathing is just bad enough that I would rather go without. At least when I'm exploring. I guess I could always tell him to stay. Then maybe, then maybe he would shut the hell up. But <sighs> Well, that was disappointing. I'm going to stop the video. Um, I'll get back to you guys once I find a good cave. Oh, and if I survive the night.